Now let's talk about the weather on the Apple Watch because it may be a little bit interesting because you can of course uh, just set the weather for your complications and pretty much anything that you do. So no matter which uh, complication or which watch face you set on your uh, Apple Watch, you still have the option to choose the weather to be there. And now the question is, if you have multiple weather locations, which one is going to be the one on your home screen? You can see, for example, here is one degree, but which location is it? Now, in this one, let's take a look at the default location. So if you open up the weather app on your uh, Apple Watch, uh, you can find it somewhere around in here. So if you tap on it, you can add as many cities as you want. If you scroll to the bottom, here is the add a city button. And you can just type in whatever you want. These are the same cities that you can also have on your iPhone, but the settings that you can change and you are supposed to change are only to be found on the iPhone in the, the watch app. So you're going to have to find the watch um, app, click on here, and you can see here are all of my settings and all of the things that uh, apply to my watch. But I have to scroll down to find the weather section. So here is the weather and here is the mirror my iPhone and custom settings for notifications, but here is also the default city. So default city can be anything what I want. So it can be the current location where I'm in. That means that my Apple Watch complication and watch face is gonna display the current location of my position. Or it can be one of the cities that I picked from. So here at the bottom, you can see, choose which city's weather you would like to see in watch face complications. You can add or delete cities using the weather app on your iPhone. And because it is synced, it doesn't matter if you add a city on the watch or on the iPhone weather app. As long as it's somewhere where your Apple ID is set, then it's going to be, um, it's going to apply to your Apple watch as well. So this would be it. And this is how you can uh, set up and choose the default city for your uh, Apple watch. So thanks a lot for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe here to Fox Tech and also check out the next video about weather. Thanks a lot for watching and see you guys later in the future.